Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with a vlog sale. A friend of mine um, was looking to downsize her luxury handbag collection and had reached out and asked if I would help her out and do a vlog sale on my channel since she is not on YouTube. And um, I said gladly since she has a beautiful handbag collection and I think she's got some great items here for some great deals for anyone who may be interested. So I've got a lot of stuff to get through. I've got some handbags, some SLGs, and some accessories. And before I get into it, I just wanted to mention a few sort of housekeeping things. Um, I will be listing all of the items with pricing down below. And um, uh, these have been priced um, to be paid via PayPal friends and family. So um, if you are not wanting to pay that way, then you can certainly reach out to her and let her know. And um, I'm sure you could work something out based on extra fees or anything else associated with. But the pricing below is, um, and it will state that it is via PayPal, friends and family. And um, also she will be, ha I will list her email down below so you can contact her directly um, with any questions you may have or um, if you're interested in any of these pieces. And I have some information about all these items that I'll be looking down at my notes um, so that I don't forget anything. and. Um, I know what the names of all the pieces are and everything like that. So I'm going to jump in and get started with some handbags from Louis Vuitton since I think most of the handbags I have here to show you are from Louis Vuitton. So the first one, um, oh, and the other thing is most of her items, she takes great care of everything, and most of her items um, do come with their dust bags and packaging, whatever she received when she purchased it. So. Um, just wanted to mention that ahead of time as well. So the first item comes in this dust bag and this is a bag from Louis Vuitton. So it is the Neverfull in the GM size in the Damier Aben print. And this is the new model, it's in excellent condition. As I mentioned, she takes really great care of her bags. Um, there's just, I guess, some normal wear and tear as most of us who are familiar with the uh, Damier Aben Neverfulls, you know, they get some little, um, wrinkles and things along the edges there, but it is in great condition. It has the pouch inside, and the best part of this bag is that she is made in France. I'm not sure if the camera will pick that up, but um, it's a beautiful bag in excellent condition and one that I was considering purchasing off of her. However, I really don't need another Neverfull in my life, but um, yeah, I will put all the information about this bag down below but really nothing more to say than just a really great practical bag. And again, this is in the GM size, which is great for travel, great for work. And um, yeah, the next Louis Vuitton bag comes in this dust bag. And it is the Palm Springs mini backpack. And this is the World Traveler limited edition. Limited edition. It's no longer available. Um, it's in excellent condition. Um, it's a collector series. And I believe she's got it stuffed with the um, crossbody strap inside along with the care card information. And um, there's even the tags and everything from when she purchased this. I know this is a piece that she did not get that much use out of. As I said, it's in really, really great condition. And um, it's absolutely a little beauty. Definitely a great deal. So I will list all of the pricing and information on this piece down below. And the next bag, which is, I believe, another um, limited edition, comes in this dust bag. And it is the Twist Chain Wallet. This is in the Epi Leather in the denim print, or the Epi Denim, I guess it's called. So it has the twist lock there, opens up really, really cute. I actually really loved this piece and I wish that they came out with it in just some um, solid colors versus all the um, sort of graphic designs and things that this came out in. It's got six credit card slots and she's got the care card and just some air paper inside here. This is in excellent condition. Um, it's a collector piece and it's got some red stitch trim, silver hardware. I don't know if you can see the stitching there. Silver hardware, and um, she mentioned that there were some hairline scratches on the twist lock, but nothing that um, I can even see. So I would say this is in really excellent condition. 
And here is the strap here, and it says Louis Vuitton on the top. So it's really comfortable to wear. I actually tried this on in store myself. Um, I like it as a long shoulder bag, but you could also wear a crossbody. It's just a really versatile little piece. So that is the twist chain wallet in the Epi denim. Next up from Louis Vuitton, we have another bag that I dyed when I saw that she is selling and she's got everything packaged up really nicely. This is the Lock Me 2. Sorry, gotta just move the wrap. The Lock Me 2, this is in the noir or black color um, with palladium hardware or palladium brass. And I'm just gonna open her up so you can see all the details of this bag. It has a twist lock in the front where the LVs are, so it just twists like so. Um, she's made in France. She's in excellent condition. She's made of a soft calf leather. And as you can see, um, you can use this as a top handle bag or inside there is a strap that you can attach to make it a long shoulder bag. There's a big compartment in the front with a smaller one in the back. And I believe it says made in France. Sorry, I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> This is made of beautiful leather. Um, of all the Louis Vuitton bags that I've come across in just a solid leather, this is one of the nicest looking, I think, in terms of just the quality of the leather. It's absolutely beautiful. So that is what that looks like. It's got the clochette here. And um, again, it's got the strap. And the last Louis Vuitton bag comes in this drawstring dust bag. This is another beautiful piece that I had considered for myself. This is the Petite Noé in the Epi Leather in the color Fuchsia. Absolutely beautiful bag. She's got it stuffed with air paper, but it is in just excellent condition. It's got a little zip pocket in the back, which is really nice. The regular Noé does not have that. Um, it is made in France also, which I think it says over on the side, one of the sides. Yeah, over here. And she mentioned a slight mark on the base of this bag, which I am not even finding right now, but apparently there is one slight scuff near the base of the bag, but I can't even see it. So I'm just holding it up to the light so you can see what that looks like in really great condition and I will put all the details down below. So the next handbag I have to show you is from Saint Laurent and it comes in this beautiful dust bag. I have to say this is the first Saint Laurent dust bag I have ever touched and it is really really um, a beautiful dust bag. <laughs> and the bag itself is even more stunning. So this is the Sac Du Jour um, it is the top stitch satchel bag in the size small. Looks like this. The color is cognac with the white stitching, which you can see when I hold it up close. This bag has never been used. It is brand spanking new. And inside it has one zip compartment in the middle. And then it's got the long strap. And those of you who are familiar with this bag, I'm sure you know everything that it comes with. Um, it's got the five feet on the bottom that still have the stickers. And um, on the clochette, I believe there's a little lock inside there. Yep. And yeah, it's absolutely a stunning, stunning bag for anyone who is looking for a sac du jour. And I was really surprised about the size of it. This is a small, but it's a really great, I would say, everyday size. Next up, we have a bundle from Burberry, <laughs> and um, she's selling this as a bundled price. Um, if you decide to purchase everything, um, I think the pricing is better to do it that way, but if you are interested in any of these pieces by themselves or just a few of them, you could certainly reach out to her and work something out. So with the bundle, you would get the uh, small Gladstone Haymarket tote. This was purchased at the Burberry outlet and it comes with this little um, tag on the front. 
You've got a lot of organization in this bag. In the back, there is a large zipper pocket. In the front, you've got two pockets. And then inside, there's also a shoulder strap. This is in really good condition, and it has kind of a dark brown leather trim and the traditional Burberry check print. And then as also part of the bundle, you would get this matching wallet in this dark brown color, just says Burberry in the front, pretty understated wallet in really good condition. And then this is a zip around wallet and on the inside it has what appear to be six credit card slots on one side and you have the Burberry check on the little gussets on the inside and then six credit card slots on the other side, same deal. So lots of room for plenty of credit cards, cash, and anything else you may need. Really smooth zipper and in really good condition. And then a few other things that are included in this bundle. There is a cosmetics pouch um, or a cosmetics case. And this is the Black Studs Cosmetics case. Um, this was purchased pre-loved and it looks like this. It has the same sort of matching a little bit larger Burberry check print or design. And it's got a really smooth zipper. And this just has a few marks inside from being used. But other than that, this is in really great condition and has been kept stuffed, has not lost its shape. And um, just another great matchy matchy little piece. And then also included in the bundle, <laughs> Um, is this cosmetics pouch, which I believe this is just called a cosmetics pouch. This one was also purchased at the Burberry outlet. It's got the Burberry check design in really, really good condition. And then you've got this leopard print on the sides. This is a really nice soft canvas material. And then the inside of it, a little air paper. Um, it has a little pocket in the back, which is really nice. You can see that. And then it's got the um, leopard print design inside as well. Really smooth zipper and it's really got a cute little tassel pull there. So that is the cosmetics pouch. And then the last piece in this bundle I believe is the medium size agenda which um, this has the same type of rings or holds the same paper as the Louis Vuitton MM agenda. And um, looks like this. And this is also in great condition and she purchased this pre-loved as well. And next up I have another piece from Burberry. It comes in this drawstring bag. And this is the Meguiar tote in blue suede. And it has this black leather strap. It's a real soft blue, kind of a royal blue suede color. And um, it's also suede on the inside. I don't know if the camera is picking that up. But yeah, really, really cute. It's kind of an oblong um, rectangle shape. And as you can see, it's adjustable. So you can adjust the length of this. You could wear it. Um, crossbody or just on your shoulder and it's just a nice smushy suede bag. Next up we have a um, leather tote from Gucci. This is the Gucci dark brown Guccissima tote. I think that's how you say it. Looks like this. It's got the little double G's all over it and no marks, no feet on the bottom but um, in really good condition. It's got a zip on the top, so those who are not fans of tote bags because they're too open and don't have any privacy, you have a nice zip on the top there. We've got a large zip compartment in the back, and it just says Gucci all over. It's got kind of a wipeable lining inside, and then there is a little cell phone pocket or a couple of pockets on the other side. It's just your average or large, I would say, size um, tote bag. It says Gucci right there. And this piece is made in Italy. And it's a dark brown color that could almost pass for black, but it's great for an office environment or 
um, just if you wanted something to use as a tote bag or even a diaper bag. It's a really, really soft, um, amazing leather. I will say Gucci does amazing leather. And nearing the end of handbags here, I have two bags from Mansur Gabriel. And these come in these beautiful linen-y dust bags. The first one is, this is the Mansur Gabriel bucket bag in the black color with the red interior. This bag has a long shoulder strap that you could also wear crossbody and um, comes with a little zip pouch inside. It, as I mentioned, has a beautiful red interior, no pockets. It's in great condition and you can see um, on the bottom there, there is the care card. And this bag was ordered from the Mansur Gabrielle website. It is made in Italy and it is made of an Italian vegetable tanned leather in absolutely excellent condition. So that is the first of the two bags. The second one I have right here, also in the drawstring dust bag. And this is in the Carmelo or Camello Rosa. So it's kind of a camel color on the outside. Really, really simple tote bag. Beautiful smooth leather. And then it's got the Rosa or kind of pinkish interior. This also comes with the zippered pouch. And it is also made in Italy and ordered from the website. This is a great, very, I think both bags are great if you're looking for something very minimalist and simple um, design-wise. I think they're both beautiful bags. And last up for handbags, and a handbag that I had considered purchasing, but again, I really don't need it, but it's a really great bag. Um, it's from Tory Burch, and it comes in this dust bag. This is the Perry Tote in the color Marlin with the silver lining. Here we go. Sorry, she's got it so well stuffed it's hard to actually get it out of the dust bag. <laughs> this bag has never been used. It's new with tags. She's still got the sticker here on the little logo in the front. It's in perfect condition. And it's in this gorgeous, I almost would call this a periwinkle um, color, perfect for spring. And even as I'm seeing it on camera right now, I'm dying because <laughs> I would love to have this bag in my own collection. Uh, those are who are familiar with um, this bag, you know that it comes with, you can see the tags are still on it there, but it comes with a pocket here where I usually put um, my keys and then another smaller park pocket in front of that. Aside from that, um, it's just a nice silver lining throughout the bag. Again, it is brand new, never been used, and absolutely gorgeous and I'm going to be thinking about this myself when I post this video. Um, she's got it listed for a great price and um, it's just a beautiful bag and I can speak to the fact that the Tory Burch um, Perry Tote is actually one of my favorite totes I've ever owned in my handbag collection for work. It's just a really nice soft pebbled leather, doesn't really show signs of wear and um, it's a workhorse. It'll carry a ton so Great, great bag. Okay, so moving into accessories, I'm gonna start with some Louis Vuitton accessories. Here's the first one, it comes in this dust bag. I'm gonna to try to speed up a little since I know I'm using up a ton of time on this. Um, but this is the Louis Vuitton Sarah wallet and it is in excellent condition. However, she has mentioned that the some of the leather has started to turn out and this is a piece that was hardly used but um, I have seen some Louis Vuitton wallets that do that when the um, the canvas is kind of thin um, and not sort of stitched on to like the leather like this leather, this sort of more, I don't know what to call it, sturdy leather. <laughs> so yeah, a, a few pieces um, have started to bend a little bit, but aside from that, um, it's been barely used, bought in 2014. There are four credit card slots in the front and then you've got 
six on one side in the front, six on the other side in the back, and the coin compartment in the middle, zip compartment in the middle. And then there is, sorry, another flat pocket in the way back there. So in great condition, aside from that happening, which I've seen with other Louis Vuitton wallets, but um, yeah. And she's got this also listed at a great price. Next piece comes in this dust bag, and it is the Multicarts monogram with the fuchsia interior. And, or the fuchsia trim and interior, I should say. This piece is made in France and it is like new condition. Holds a ton of cards. Next Louis Vuitton SLG comes in this dust bag and it is the cosmetic case in the PM or small size. This is in really excellent condition. Shows like no signs of wear at all. And I can feel that she has this stuffed. <laughs> I'll just quickly unstuff it and show you the interior. And it too is made in France. Next piece comes in this dust bag. And this is the Louis Vuitton Toiletry 26. It is also made in France and it is in really good condition. She mentioned there's a small mark on the interior. Pull these out. Yeah, you can see some lipstick or something got on the inside of this. She did purchase this pre-loved and said that was there when she got it. But aside from that, it is in really great condition. No marks on the outside, no signs of wear on the outside of this. Really, really great piece and one that I may consider myself in the future. The next Louis Vuitton SLG comes in this dust bag. And this is the card holder in the Bernie leather in the color Amarant. This is an absolutely stunning piece. It is in excellent condition. And the inside, she's even got the inside stuffed with like a little tiny Louis Vuitton. I don't know if that's a dust bag or just a cloth, but yeah. And this is made in Spain. You can see that. Really, really great piece. Next up, we have a pair of Louis Vuitton sunglasses. They come in this really cute little drawer box. And these have actually, they're brand new, never been used. There they are in their case. And inside here is the care booklet. Really thick. And inside here are the sunglasses in the soft case. And these are the, if I'm going to say this right, Hortensia cat eye. I'm not sure if I'm saying that. Um, in the color brown, they look like this. They have some beautiful details on the side. You can see that. And on the other side in the corners, they say Louis Vuitton. And these are made in Italy. They look like this on. <laughs> really, really nice cat eye sunglasses and brand new, never been used. So great deal on these. And the last few Louis Vuitton pieces are both shawls. And I'm not sure which one is which, but um, they both come in their box with the tissue paper impeccably packed up. This one is the monogram shawl in the color Verone. This one has never been used. The tags are still attached. So there are no snags. It is brand new. Great deal for anyone who was interested in this beautiful neutral color that goes with everything. I wish I could buy it myself, but I have too many Louis Vuitton shawls already and really can't justify purchasing, but a uh, really great deal for someone who's been looking for a Louis Vuitton shawl. And then I have another in this box. And this one is also like new um, in the color Cassis and has no snags. Just open the tissue paper here. 
gorgeous color. Absolutely to die for. So if you're interested in a like new, practically in-store experience, the way these are packaged so nicely, um, definitely let her know. And then a few last accessories. I have some jewelry here. The first one is from Chanel and it comes in this box. And she has kept the tag and all the packaging for this. This is a bracelet. There is the little Chanel logo. And opening it up, the bracelet looks like this. It is, sorry, just making sure I say exactly what it is. It's a silver CC bracelet with crystals in excellent condition and really, really pretty. And the next Chanel piece of jewelry comes in this box. And the little teeny tiny packaging here, so pretty. You can see inside the box, she has kept the tags. And in here, we have a pair of earrings. These are black enamel earrings with gold which I think are absolutely stunning. I would say they're kind of a medium size CC earrings. And because there are no um, crystals on these, you don't have to worry about anything kind of falling off. So that's really great. And then last but not least, we have one piece of jewelry from Hermes. And I was sad to see her sell this because she inspired me to get one of these myself. This comes in the beautiful Hermes packaging. And it is, of course, the um, Click H bracelet, if I'm going to say that right. Hers is slightly different from the one I got. It is in the um, black or noir with palladium hardware. And hers has the um, noir letter H done in the enamel, whereas mine, I think, is silver there. But absolutely gorgeous piece. And I'm going to just try it on and show you how this looks. Since I've become so good at putting these, taking these on, put it, putting these on and taking them off. So there it is with my watch, my Clues watch. And um, it was her who I first saw wearing this that I decided I have very small wrists and it's always hard for me to find a bracelet that fits me well, especially if it's just like a bangle. And um, this looked so nice on her. I can't, I couldn't believe she was selling it. But in any case, um, it's in excellent condition. She says there's minor scratches, but I really can't even tell. And that is it for this blog sale. Um, I thank you all for watching. If you are interested in any of these pieces, I will have all the information, pricing, as well as Tanya's contact information via email down below. So you can reach out to her directly if you're interested in any pieces or if you have any questions or anything to follow up on. I thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a great rest of the week and I will see you soon in my next video. Bye.